should be three days since I finished the last vlog and today my plan is to go downstream and check if Pike Bay is fully open. And before I paddle downstream, this week is what I call my tired week because I work seven days and go up very early in the morning. So when I come home, it is very hard for me to go outside and do something outdoor. Some days it is very hard to come outside and do something, but I do it because I know every time I do it, I recharge my batteries and get like happiness and joy. And um, this is what the vlog is about, to share the happiness of being outdoor. And today, when the sun is shining, it is easier to come out. Now, let's paddle downstream. You can see, if you remember from last vlog, that it is less ice here. I recharge my batteries best by paddling, but how do you recharge your batteries? Drop a comment. And uh, the moon is up. <laughs> you can both see it in the water and up in the sky. This is so beautiful. And now let's see if it is open here in backyard or if it's closed no it is not fully opened yet but i think it looks like it is possible to get through here when i bought this new nsp board i said i'm not going to break ice during the winter i have done that a little bit already with this board but I think it is time to break some ice with this NSP board and see if it's just as good as starboard to break ice. Finally, backyard is fully open. <laughs> this is so good. Now I can paddle my normal uh, exercise trip every day. I just want to say this. If you try to break ice with your paddle board, remember that it can damage the board. So. Yeah, if you care about your board, don't break ice. If you want to have fun and can repair or buy a new board, break ice. I think this is beaver. I really hope it is beaver. That's one of my favorite animals. And up there, I think that is track from the mink. This was not so clever to unclick this. It went down here, but we sold it. Or maybe I sold it. But it is really beautiful with the sun shining on the white snow. Do you hear? The birds are singing. <laughs> Even they think it is spring now.
I've been out paddling every day. Now I'm just enjoying the moment, talking to you, floating downstream in the river. I was supposed to start upstreams, but it's better to talk with you here. It will be quite boring if I show you every paddle I do, because I paddle almost every day, but it gives me so much joy and energy to do a paddle after work every day and you might not have the time to take a paddle after work every day but maybe you can go outside and do something outdoor yeah it is the best to have some fresh air as you see it has happened a lot here in Pike Bay during these days. Yeah, in the whole river everything is melting now and it gets less and less ice every day. <laughs> I have a stand-up paddle all week. I'm sitting in the kayak today, but it seems like um, the ducks has, uh, they know who I am now, this blue guy, so they are closer and closer to me when I paddle before they fly away and now they were just right in front of the kayak. <laughs> I really love when it goes like this, they get used to me. I get more and more confidence when it comes to kayaking. In the beginning of the winter I didn't want to sit and just relax with my kayak on the ice. Now I do it. <laughs> the kayak has a keel so it is a little wobbly compared to the flat paddle board. But I still do it and have an amazing time with the kayak. It is really amazing to sit on the ice and relax and get some energy, just feel the nature. But the ducks, they made my day today. <laughs> <laughs> 